What is up, YouTube? Hi. Give it on to our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, first and foremost. Always. My name is Marcus. I'm Christian. And this is Marriage with Dummies. Reacts. Yikes. Today, we got a request from Devin, Devin Clay. Clay. What's up, Devin? <laughs> Uh, it's going to be Juice World Righteous. Uh, go ahead and like, subscribe, and we love you. We Let's do. God that. bless y'all. I love that you keep... You, it's the same guy, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. God bless you, Devin. One person. I will. I will. I I'm feeling righteous. Yeah. I know that the truth is hard to digest. Yeah. Five or six pills in my right hand. Yeah. Cody running over on my nightstand. Taking medicine to fix all of the damage. My anxiety the size of a planet. Uh, Holes in my skull. Over time, my heart's over. So I'm feeling righteous. Yeah, I know that the truth is hard to digest. Yeah, five or six pills in my right hand. Yeah, Cody running over on my nightstand. Taking medicine to fix all of the damage. My anxiety the size of a planet. Uh, Holes in my skull. Over time, my heart's over ice. Hmm. All right. Okay. <laughs> Y'all know I got something to say. Yes. Uh, uh, yeah, first, if you want us to react to a particular song you're uh, choosing, you can go into our description. We got Cash App, Venmo, PayPal links. Click on one of those, send a donation on the name of the song you want us to react to, and we'll hop right on that. Um, I love Juice World, man. I love yeah. Juice World. Uh, I just, I, I hate to see that his, his he put his faith in things other than yeah. Christ. That, he, that it was in something that was fleeting. Yeah. And that um, he, I'm not sure. Okay, look, I'm not sure what he told, talked to Christ about in his last moments. Right. You, we, we were we not still there. Don't know. Mm -hmm. So, so I, hopefully he had a discussion with Christ and, yeah. and recognized or, or uh, yeah, like had a had a come to Jesus moment, mm -hmm. as as some would say, Amen. and and recognized um, yeah, that he was leaning on the wrong things. Yeah. Um, I I again, I pray that that you youngins see because I know it's the youngins that he, uh, that love to see the. Jesus I love stories. it though. I pray that you see what him leaning on his life. I hope his life was a. Uh, 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 a warning to yeah. others that where leaning on those types of things will get you and yeah. it he, le where it leads you to as well yeah. you know we watched a we watched a genuine gift for, from god that um is the cautionary tale mm -hmm. you know what i'm saying it's a cautionary tale and uh listen man if you if he had a if he had to work for christ you know what i'm saying if he had to switch it up and work for christ and 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 that it would have been a totally different story. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? It would have been a totally different story. And um yeah, man, I I just hope y'all see it, man. Yeah. I, I really hope y'all see it. He so, the the kid is a poet. The yeah. kid was a poet, man. I was gonna say something that I figured out that I think um the truth is is that we all can relate to uh juice. And yeah. the thing is, is because that hole that's in our hearts until yeah. we know what actually belongs there, yeah. that's what it is. That's yeah. that's what he is singing about. Yeah. And he is uh, he's doing it in in his poetic, artsy way yeah. that 
is relatable because yeah. we're like, dang, yeah, I feel like that too. Yeah. And it's something like vibing with it that makes you feel it in, in your flesh. You yeah. feel it like, because you're missing the eternal God that fills that hole. Yeah. And so that's what is so relatable about juice is yeah. that because we too felt that way yeah. beforehand, like where, dang, yeah, this is what all these things are that would, that I'm going to try to push in there to, to feel right. You yeah. know what I mean? So we get it. We understand, but we also know the truth now. Yeah. And just like he said, the truth is hard to, to accept sometimes something like yeah. that. He said something about the truth, Yeah. but that, it, and that is true. But, mm -hmm. but what are you going to do about that? Yeah. You have to though. That's the way that we truly have to function and move in order yeah. to become better in life. You know what I mean? Yeah. So yeah, we pray that it helps someone. But, but yeah, he, <laughs> but yeah, uh, yeah, he will always in, he will always yeah. be remembered as a monster. Always yeah. be re remembered as an icon. Yeah. Uh, yeah. It, yeah. It, it was, it, like I said, it's a cautionary tale. Somebody as uh, gifted and as he is, and you know what I'm saying? As poetic 100%. as, uh, as uh, that, that, that was a staple. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Uh, you know what I'm saying? If to he, an entire generation. Like what? If if he can fall short to that, yeah. when he has all, when he had all of the amenities to not mm, do that, he had yeah. all of the amenities to not fall short to that, but he chose that because he was sick. You know what yeah. I'm saying? He was sick. So uh, just let it be a cautionary tale, man. And mm -hmm. uh, yeah. I love it. Yeah. Let's get back to it. I'm in too deep Can't swim like me When you're drowning So I will see My demons turn fierce Under me Inhale, exhale, but I can't breathe Too busy drinking codeine Doing high speed So I'm feeling righteous I know that the truth is hard to digest Five or six pills in my right hand Cody running over on my nightstand Taking medicine to fix all of the damage My anxiety the size of a planet Holes in my skull Over time, my heart's over crazy y'all uh -huh. is that he even spoke on it and may not have even known that that's for yeah. real that's pretty crazy yeah. okay that's how that's how uh spiritual realm works yes and how yeah. tricky that satan is that yeah. he even is saying it that yeah the devil's in my head these demons da, da, da. Uh -huh. dude yeah that's really true though yeah. that's really what it is yeah. like and in a sense, when you do drugs, because we've been there, yeah. um, <laughs> you uh, you kind of tap into the spiritual realm. And that's yeah. where things get tricky and dangerous because yeah. we are not only flesh and body. We are spiritual beings. Yeah. And so when you tap into that, yeah. that's why it can get really scary and dangerous. And yeah. it can lead you to death. It can lead you to worse things yeah. <clears throat> because... You're tapping into that and dealing with things entity wise that um, Satan is keeping you blinded from. Yeah. He makes it seem like, oh, it feels so good to your flesh and to to your mind in the moment. Yeah. But then why do you have all this junk afterwards? Why do you yeah. feel so down after you take it? Why do you yeah. feel this anxiety that you can't get rid of when you're in the, your normal state now? Yeah. And that's the trick of the devil. And then he even, you know, uses the, the verbiage yeah. of the devil is in my head and these demons and that's exactly what it is though. So yeah. I hope that makes sense that, um, he may not have known in the moment that yeah. that was really what was, uh, occurring, but it yeah. was, 
you know? So I hope that makes sense if, if I worded that right. <laughs> I say let Jesus take the wheel because he know how to drive. Yeah. Because we overcorrect. Yeah. So what we'll do is, all right, you try to use the drugs to level you out. <laughs> oh, yeah. okay. Now I got to use the drug to do this get yeah. over this on side, this side. <laughs> and now I need to try this other drug to help this drug yeah. to not feel this way. I got right? it. I got it. I got it. I can figure it out. <laughs> I got you. I'm going to just keep doing this until I, yeah. and until I know how to keep it steady. But you never learn to keep it steady yeah. it, because th you're trying to, yeah, you just, you're throwing things in a, in an eternal whole yeah. you were know saying that it's it's eternal as a part of us yeah. it's eternal and that's what we need god for yeah you see so, what i'm saying if i i heard somebody say um uh uh, uh our natural habitat is god mm -hmm. okay trees trees need ground to grow they have to be in the ground in order to grow uh, uh fish have to be in water in order to swim you know what i'm saying and humans uh, we have to be in the presence of God or God has to be in us in that eternal mm. space in order for us to live Function without that we properly. die yeah wow so that's without that real. we use other things to try to put it in there to sustain it and you Beautifully can't sustain said. it the the, mm. the fuel is an eternal fuel yeah. and it's God so like it, but the other things are are yeah they are fleeting man wow but, yeah. that's beautifully said yeah just know yeah. that um you're not just flesh and body you are yeah. spirit and yeah. so there's more to just this life yeah. and that is an eternal life and an eternal whole with an eternal god yeah and he is real so mm -hmm. we love you god bless you and we'll see you in the next video mm -hmm. <laughs>